I found I could say things with color and shapes, uh, things I couldn't say any other way, um, things I had no words for. It's actually, it's a favorite quote by George O'Keefe and it kind of describes how I feel uh, about my art and how I communicate with the world. Um, I think it, it is exactly how I feel actually. <laughs> I fell in love with the water when I was a, a child. Um, my family and I would spend a couple of weeks every summer in um, Polly's Island and uh, in the same beach house um, there. Um, and it was just a very, just a, one of those shabby shacks. And there was no air, there was no um, TV. You know, we had to wash our own dishes and, and you know, it was just very simple. Um, screen and porches and we would all, the whole family would go and hang out. And uh, the beach it was just a really special, special time. Um, it was uh, my, some of my happiest memories growing up. And I remember just staring at the water and, and just feeling that, that light, the sparkle. I used to call it diamond water when I was young. And that's kind of, um, when I look back at it, I think that that's where I really found my inspiration. I, um, I think I felt this sense of euphoria, and I wanted to share that with, with other people. Beaufort, to me, is charm and beauty, and um, it's, it's, it's pretty special. Uh, my husband and I, when we were at SCAD, we, um, we would come over to Hunting Island um, and camp out there, and it was just, we really enjoyed that raw beauty, the, um, just that simple, untouched nature that uh, we just kind of fell in love with it then. And we also, we'd come to downtown Beaufort, and it was very charming, and, um, and I think we just wanted to always get back to, to that. I started my uh, reflection series about 16 years ago. Um, after um, my husband and I uh, traveled around for a bit, we, f we settled at Lake Murray. And um, our dock was right there on the lake. And we, we, uh, I, I would go down to the, to the water with my one-year-old at the time. And um, I, I would just take it in. She would throw stones in the water. And I just really enjoyed that, that motion and the light. Again, I was so inspired by it. Um, so I decided to start doing uh, these small paintings and thumbnails um, from life, uh, the motion and um, color and light. And um, I started doing large pieces from that. And uh, for about three years I did it, plain air, um, from life. And then I, I decided I wanted something a little more and I wanted it to be more of an expression, um, more of a release of emotion. So I started painting it from memory. So, um, and now it's been kind of an evolution. Um, it's been quite a journey and now you have what I, I paint today, which is um, a little bit more abstract. It's uh, a lot of motion, a lot of emotion, and it's really liberating to paint that way. It's a, it's a feeling that I get when I'm by the water, um, kind of that euphoria from when I was a kid. And I think that that's where I found, finally found that place when I was painting it from life. Um, I think I got the rhythm down and the, um, that light and that sparkle, that motion, and I just, I, I think I, I drank it up and, and then I just, I, I take it to the canvas and um, release it there. We live right on the water and uh, I call it my floating piece of artwork. My husband uh, created for us and uh, we love it. We absolutely uh, adore this type of lifestyle. It's simple, it's about nature and family. It's everything we need, it's, it's wonderful. Uh, my inspiration is all around me, of course. It's a, a houseboat, so my, you look out every window and every door and there is my diamond water that I love so much. My daughter is my best piece of artwork, and she is a piece of work. She's, um, she's very creative. Uh, my husband and I met at SCAD, so she's, uh, she's, she's very creative herself. She's, Hannah is good at everything, and I think her challenge in this world is going to be uh, narrowing it down to one thing, and she doesn't even have to do it, just do one thing. Um, 
She is going to be 17, and uh, I, I can't believe it. I feel like she just came into this world, and she is the light of my life, and that's the reason I do everything. If I if I'm doing anything, that I'm I'm. I want their perspective on the world to be a little different because I see the world a little different and I hope that they see that. When they look at my work, I, I want them to feel what I feel and, uh, and I think that I hope I, I share that joy um, that I feel when I'm near the water.